Yeah, we look really good. I think so. Stumpbomb Kitchen, Stumpbomb Kitchen, gluten free, vegan, eats, and Stumptastic Treats for two. Hi! Welcome to Stump Kitchen. Hello! <laughs> this is Sean. What are we making today, Sean? Uh, a hot chocolate. <laughs> The first thing we're gonna do before we even start is sanitize our limbs. Safety first in a pandemic. Uh, oh, the smell! So alcoholy. Mmm. You might. <coughs> you want to let it like soak off a little bit, like air off. Oh god. That's beautiful. Do you ever get the question from people? I often do, mostly from little kids, which is re really sweet. How do you wash your hands? Or how do you put on hand sanitizer with one hand? Right. <laughs> and this is how. You just use all your limbs and do it like this. But do you ever get that question? Oh yeah, well, I mean, I mean, occasionally little kids will be like, well, how do you wash your hands? And I say, well, with water. <laughs> right? <laughs> That's really strong. You used a lot. <laughs> Do you want to get rid of some? Yeah. Okay. Put some on okay. me. I'll take some more. <laughs> All right, now we're germ free. <coughs> we're not gonna call it. There's hand sanitizer on the table. I'm just gonna wait. <laughs> Well, we can add it to the hot chocolate. Oh gosh! So we're making hot chocolate. This is one of those things that I like to make. Where you just chuck things off the table, like whatever. I like making hot chocolate when you're like, oh crap, I don't have any cookies, I don't have any chocolate, I don't have any treats in the house. So this is like a treat when you don't have any treats. Yeah. And I found a recipe from Chocolate Covered Katie. It looked really delicious online, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna give it a shot. Have you ever made hot chocolate before? Oh, more times than I would like to admit. Really? Well, I don't know if I call myself an expert, but maybe a maybe a connoisseur. Maybe what we can do is you can take the lead. And you can teach me how to do this in a good way. I, I, I mean, I, I, I can try. Okay, excellent. So here's what you have. You have Stanley, you got a pot, measuring cups, measuring spoons, milk, marshmallows, cocoa, maple syrup, vanilla, a tiny bit of salt, and a teeny tiny whisk, because the other one's in the wash. We should double this so we can each have a cup. One cup of milk of choice, which would be this milk. <laughs> yes, yes. coconut milk. Three teaspoons, no, three tablespoons. Mm -hmm. No, that's tea, no. No, it's tablespoons. Yeah, it's tablespoons. <laughs> TBSP is tablespoons, yeah. Okay, great. This yeah. is why you read recipes before you start. It's important because then you know what you're doing. That's the Dutch cocoa. Yeah, it, it's actually just regular cocoa, but we oh. can pretend it's fancy Dutch cocoa. <laughs> we can put some shoes on it that are wooden. <laughs> You're funny. Oh, and then the vanilla extract. It's not pure as they ask for because that is <laughs> expensive, so it's <laughs> artificial. Here, it's all at your fingertips. Oh, what words do you use to describe your arm? Oh, um, I would usually talk about my arm or my hand. Okay, cool. Yeah. I like to pretend like I can operate just as anybody else would. Absolutely. Um, doesn't always work out. Which like we that. can. <laughs> Mostly we can, yeah. yeah. But yeah, I mean, I don't usually use any any special words. I mean, you know, I've got my nubbins, but that's the only other. We're very, very similar, actually. Yeah. We both have a thumb. And yeah, all of our little fingers. So I just call these my fingers. Mm -hmm. You use nubbins. And then I'll, I'll use stump or, yeah, left arm, left hand. Often I will use to because it just comes naturally, I guess. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Take it away, chef. Oh, right. Um, so I find in hot chocolate mm -hmm. that if you just throw the ingredients in oh. and go wild, what? It increases the amount of love and haphazard, haphazard chaos that goes in. Okay. And then life is good, right? Let's do it. Dutch cocoa. Boom. Okay, three, three tape. Tablespoon is TBSP, teaspoon is TSP. I have never cooked in my life. <laughs> You're so delicate and fancy. You're I... just trying. Just like... okay. <laughs> it's okay if you make a mess, you know that, right? In some kitchen, you can oh, be messy. Can I do it deliberately? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> That's what this show's all about. I mean, it's usually my, my child guests that are the ones that are deliberately messy, but you are more than welcome, my friend. <laughs> this is one tablespoon. That's one tablespoon. Oh, okay, we gotta do this six times. <laughs> oh, right, because we're doubling it. And yours are like heaping tablespoons, and I really like that. If you can't indulge in life, what are you doing, right? Absolutely. I've lost count. Have you been counting? Maybe that was three. <laughs> that was three. Or four? I don't think you can have too much cocoa in hot chocolate, right? Okay, let's let's err on the side of indulgence. Right? Yeah. That might be six, or it might be seven, or it might be eight. Or... <laughs> oh, that was very, very good. The, the, the sweetener. Maple syrup? Oh. Yes. Mm -hmm. And this technique, I just want to say, is fantastic. You're like using the, the pot to balance on. It's the, this is so, so good. Oh, and the flourish. Yes. I love it when my guests do all the work because then I'm just like. 
<laughs> if you'd like to participate, Alexis, you're welcome to. Yeah, okay, okay, maybe I'll do, I'll do the pinch of salt, how about that? <laughs> okay. So, do you actually not cook a lot, or do you cook a lot? Uh, or do my... you just make hot chocolate at home? Is that all you live on? My cooking skills are limited to the microwave and Uber Eats. Um, <laughs> so, I'm just gonna do a couple stuff. Shakes. Is that the time? Beautiful. And it's okay if you get other things dirty. I think you're trying to be so clean, and it's okay. This is so good. <laughs> I've got I've got syrup all over my fingers. Oh no! I know it's a hard life when you're all sticky. Stickiness is perhaps my my greatest nemesis. Oh um, yeah, some people don't like that feeling. It's a big reason that I don't cook a lot. <laughs> oh, that makes so much sense. Okay, I'm glad I know that now. So I won't ask you to like get in there with your limbs and just mix it. Back. Oh, I mean, I mean, I mean, I might have to. I mean, you might have to. You never uh, really know. I, Vanilla extract. One whole teaspoon. One whole teaspoon because we're doubling it. Oh, yeah, you got it. Yes. Again with the nice side pot hold technique. This is wonderful. Boom. Mm. Now give it a throw. So now what, chef? What do we do? Uh, milk, right? Milk time? No! <laughs> it's okay, you dropped it. No! No! <laughs> what have I done? You've just become a perfect guest on Stump Kitchen. Here you are. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. He's even cleaning up after himself. <laughs> what the heck? He's the best guest ever. Uh, clean kitchen, clean... Soul? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at that milk. <laughs> It's so milky. Yes! Uh, Pardon me. The precision. It's just... This is what I live for. <laughs> and now we've got... Stanley. Stanley. Stanley's just so happy. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. You should see when he has onions stuck in his eye, still smiling. <laughs> he does not give a sh Wait! We have to do the Whisk It Up song. Whisk it up. Whisk it up. Whisk it, whisk it, whisk it. But you have to whisk while you do it. Oh. <laughs> Whisk it up, whisk it up, whisk it, whisk it, whisk it up. When do we put it on the heat, Master Chef? Oh, I suppose it's got to be hot chocolate. Yeah, we have to heat it up. Let's bring that to a boil. Look at this technique, though. It's so smooth. It's very thick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we gotta put these these marshmallows in. In now? I think you should throw some of those into my mouth. That's how I open bag. Yes, do it. Do it. <laughs> So strong, do it! Yes! Oh my god! Can I try? This isn't working. If I. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, so what would you do in this case? Dial a friend? Where's my lifeline? Scissors! Oh, I have scissors probably. Yeah! There you go. Could use your teeth, but you know, pandemics. Jewels, not tools. Oh my gosh, we're going right. Okay. Ah! Oh, that was overhand. Uh oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh my god! So good. Oh mm. my god, for the first try. Part of the joy I find with hot chocolate is just eating the marshmallows. Mm -hmm. Just eating them. You know? And starting to smell like like mm. a chocolate brownie. Oh. Here we go. Which one do you want? You're like, not the one with the dust in it. I'll get a new one. Yeah. Holy Never shit. had so much cocoa in my mouth one time. <laughs> it's really intense. I think I think we gotta add some more milk. Okay. Mmm. Ready? I might have added too much salt, but that's okay. But like, salt in sweet things is so nice because it brings out the flavor. Mm. Too much salt in sweet things, you're just eating a salty thing. Blah, blah. Blah, blah. Pardon me. Stat! Wait, what do they say in med school? Cloth! Stat! Okay, I'll be your nurse. Here you go, sir, doctor. <laughs> there you go. It's it's serrated. Yeah, for grapefruit, so you can like scoop out the grapefruit. Oh! And it just adds a nice fun texture if it's your only cereal spoon left. I think you're gonna like this version. I have a good feeling about it. It's, it's really impactful. Like, it's rich. Yeah. It, it's rich. It hits like a freight train, and I love it. Okay, great. Faster the better, just like a band-aid, rip it off. Oh. Nailed it! Is this a part of med school training? It may or may not be. <laughs> All right, now, how many marshmallows do you put on yours? Well, I mean, we have such a large bag. Yeah. I think we could go half and half. <laughs> oh, yeah! I can have the rest of these? Sure, <laughs> if you want to. Oh, wow. Oh. 
You're full on with joy over here. Uh -huh. Here's a taste test to see how our vegan fancy dancy treat, when there's no treats in the house, how chocolate tastes like. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Mm -hmm. yeah. Holy shit, it's really hot and really good. Oh my god. That's amazing. <laughs> it's really rich. What are your final thoughts? It's very hot. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. This was absolutely amazing. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, this is really, really good. What mm -hmm. else do you want to see us make? Comment down below. If you haven't already, I'd love it if you subscribe to Stump Kitchen on YouTube. You can also support Stump Kitchen on Patreon if you want to. We'll, uh, we'll see you next time on Stump Kitchen. Bye! Stump Bum Kitchen, Stump Bum Kitchen, gluten free, vegan, eats a stump tastic treats. treats for two. Did you burn yourself? Uh, I, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs>